Welcome back. In this video, we'll talk about the function of cytochrome P450, and we'll have a mnemonic for all the inducers and inhibitors. Cytochrome P450 is an enzyme found in the liver, and it breaks down these following medications. To remember them, I remember WCAT, so warfarin, contraceptive pills, anti-epileptic medications like phenytoin and carbamazepine, and theophylline, which we use in asthma. Inducers are medications that enhance cytochrome P450 and thus cause more breaking of WCAT. So when you take inducers, you will have lower levels of WCAT. To remember the inducers, I remember CARS.PNG. These are carbamazepine, chronic alcoholism, rifampine, St. Johnson wort, which we use for depression, phenytoin and phenobarbital, nivirapine, and cruzofulvin. Inhibitors, similarly, are medications that inhibit cytochrome B450, so nothing will break WCAT and they will have higher levels in the blood. To remember these medications, I remember that if I'm ever inhibited or sedated or lazy, I would want some coffee. So to remember the inhibitors, I ask for some coffee. These are isoniazide for TB, acute alcoholism, sodium valproate, which is an anti-epileptic, ketoconazole, Fluconazole, which is antifungal medication, sulfonamides, omeprazole, which is a PPI, mitronidazole, erythromycin, ciprofloxacin, and chloramphenicol, which we don't use anymore. Alright, guys, that's all I have. Thanks a ton for watching. Hopefully, this helps, and I'll see you guys later.